South today, Compton. Bit of an anxious wait then, haven't they? Now, it started out as a dream that could bring the community together. And two years down the line, Lordswood Village Store in West Sussex is a success story. It was built from scratch and its profits are spent on local projects. Today, they're celebrating, as it's just been named the best corner shop in the country. Daniel Glavin has more. The nearest shop used to be a 15-minute drive away. The store's staffed by volunteers. Shop workers and customers say it's made life better. I was new to the village, so I only came here about a month before it started. So I knew nobody. So it's helped me to um, meet new people in the village. Every village needs to have a heart. And this shop has actually become the real hub of the community. During the snow, um, people couldn't actually physically get out of the village and this became such a terrific asset. The shop opened in 2009. While they hit the headlines, it was a shaky start. The first year they made a loss, but now they've made £9,000 in profits, which would be spent in the village. Last night, they were named the best corner shop in the country by the Daily Telegraph. Mary Portis, the queen of shops, is a fan. Mary Portis herself said this could be the blueprint for many, many villages throughout the UK. And it can be done if you're determined and focused and have enough people who actually will give up their time to come and help, then this is the way to do it. Today, some came from across the county to shop here, so they're hoping for a bump a year. Daniel Glavin, BBC South Today in Lawswood. So well done to uh, Lawswood Village Store. Also, we've got to say congratulations to Caracoli in Allsford, coffee shop and deli, which picked up the award for the best small shop. It's awards all round tonight, isn't it? Everyone